Welcome everyone, I'm Pam with Windsor Mountain News. You know, I've been hearing that doctors say that we need to eat a more colorful meal, so that's why I'm eating sprinkles. We're having some astounding weather here at Windsor Mountain. Well, let's go to Ella in the field. Hello everybody, it is raining marshmallows. This is a great day for Windsor Mountain. Kids are going wild. These are delicious. Mm, mm, mm. I've heard there's a new kind of martial art. It's called Sissy Slut Fight. Let's go check it out. <laughs> Welcome back everyone. This is my special co-host Andrew. And he's got a special report from the waterfront. Andrew? Thank you, Pam. Well, the waterfront's doing okay right now, but my friend Juan isn't. He hasn't worn his life vest for six days, and now he's in trouble. Juan? I'm Juan. I think I learned my lesson, and these are pretty comfortable. Thank you, Juan. Hey, Pam, I hear there's this really cool new game. And I hear it's called Invisible Gaga. Let's go check it out. Thanks, Pam. There's a great new game called Invisible Gaga. Bob was tinkering in his shed and he came up with a way to make a rubber ball completely invisible. We're playing right now. Okay. Alan. Uh, interesting match. He's going to get a lot out. And Bob is brilliant. Jake and Marco have been talking and Jake wants Marco to put recyclable plastic and cardboard in all the campers food. Plastic and cardboard in the food? You gotta be kidding me. Let's see what Marco has drummed up in the kitchen. Hello, Jake wants me to use the recyclable paper and plastic. So here I invented a plastic tarp souffle. It consists of tarp, cheese, and salt. Absolutely delicious. You know what? I had some and it was delicious. I'm Pam, your trustworthy newscaster, signing off. Bye.